Hello children, how are you? I hope you all are fine. I'm here with the next video, lesson number two, human body. Here we begin children, lesson number two, name of the lesson is human body. This is the part one, okay, contents in this video we will cover that first one our body introduction external organs sense organs internal organs we will read these organs we will read about these organs first one brain lungs heart stomach liver and kidneys and at last we will do the exercises okay now children our body is like a machine okay as you know computer is also a machine okay and computer is having so many parts isn't it yes computer is having so many parts and all the parts are having different functions the same our body is like that our body is also made up of different different parts it is made up of different parts that help us to perform different function okay here our body is also more complicated than a computer because in computer you can see all the parts okay but in our body some of the parts you cannot see all these body parts are called organs okay now question will arise in your mind children what is an organ now here is the answer what is an organ an organ is a part of the body which performs a particular function okay it is a part of a body which performs particular function and our body consists of many organs these are divided into two parts and which are the two parts external part and internal external organs and internal organs as you can see in the picture external internal organ okay now we will read about external organ the organs of the body that you can see okay are called external organs example what are the examples here you can see here eyes hand legs nose so many examples okay are there now we will go to the next one internal organ some organs of your body that you cannot see okay because these are inside our body are called internal organs these organs present inside our body example brain heart lungs stomach liver and kidneys as you can see in the picture also okay these are internal organs understood children now we will go to the next topic that one is sense organs the sense organs are the body organs by which humans are able to see smell hear taste and touch or feel okay we all have five sense organs as you can see in the picture five sense organs now you can look here first one is eye second is nose ear tongue and skin okay these are the sense organs 
Now children, you will get a lot of information about various things in your environment through our sense organs. Okay. Now let's learn more about them one by one. Okay. First one, eyes. We can see things around us with the help of eyes. We can see their color, shape and size. Okay, children you can see the color through eyes. Color of the thing, shape of a thing and the size. So you can identify the what thing it is. You get the information through eyes. Now next one, ear. We hear with our ears. And they help us to hear different sounds around us. Okay. Different types of sounds like suppose phone, ring sound. Okay. And TV sound, your doorbell sound. These are the examples. You get the information through your ear. Next one, nose. We smell through our nose. We smell of different things. Either it is good or bad. Example, food, flour, medicines and garbage. Okay. These all the material things smell you can identify through nose now next one is tongue as you can see in the picture we know the different things taste through tongue and through tongue like sweet sour salty and bitter okay like sweet, sweet is not like your toffee. When you eat your toffee, then you get to know it is sweet. Sour, lemon, salty, salty chips and bitter in taste, medicine. Okay, these are the examples. Okay, next one and the last sense organ, that one is skin we can feel the things by touching it okay when you touch to anything then you get to know it is soft or it is hard okay this is done with the help of skin example soft hot cold these all items you get to know by touching it and that one has happened through skin okay now we will go to the next topic that one is internal organs that one is internal organ as you see in the picture so many internal organs you have already seen in the content we can not see our internal organs because they are present inside our body because they are present inside our body do you know children how we remember things and how we solve the problems do you know that yes you can think with your brain this next one next first internal organ is brain our brain help us to think, remember and solve problems. Okay. Do you know where the brain is present? Yes, it is present inside our head. As you can look in the picture. It is protected by a skull. It is the master organ of our body. Brain is the master organ of our body. Do you know why? Because it controls all the activities. You jump, you run, you play, you think, 
all the things okay that's why we call it master organ now here is function function of a function of the brain it controls every function of our body like movement breathing heartbeats etc okay now go to the our next internal organ is heart heart is situated in the chest and where it is it is situated in the center of the chest or slightly towards the left side it has four chambers it is divided into four parts it is situated in the center of the chest and it is enclosed by the rib cage okay the normal human being heart beats 72 times per minute that means in a minute human heart beats 72 times okay doctors use a stethoscope to hear the heart beat okay doctors use stethoscope now what is the function of the heart function of the heart it pumps blood to the all body parts okay it supplies the blood to all the body parts okay now next now next internal organ is lungs lungs are a pair of spongy structures present on either side of our chest they are protected by rib cage lungs are two in number one is left side and another one is right side as you can see in the picture what is the function of the lungs the the function of the lungs is to help in breathing okay next internal organ is stomach do you know children where the food goes when we eat do you know that yes when we eat food it passes to the stomach through food pipe okay as you can see in the picture this is the picture of a stomach and what is it it is a muscular organ and it is pear shaped okay its picture is its shape is like a pear it is located below the rib cage okay now next function of the stomach the food we eat is broken into small pieces or simple substance by the stomach the simple form of food is mixed with digestive juices into the stomach okay mainly we can see that the function of the stomach is digestion okay it helps in digestion okay next internal organ is liver it is the reddish brown organ located on right side of the stomach as you can look in the picture children do you know it is the largest internal organ of the body okay what is the function of this it filters and detoxifies the blood that means it cleans the blood it also helps in digestion also okay now next one kidneys 
kidneys are a pair of bean shaped organ it is a bean shaped organ its shape is like bean they are located on either side of the backbone we are also having two kidneys one is on left side and another one is on right side as you can look in the picture are the exercises true false write true or false for the following statements an organ performs a particular function it is true next one brain is protected by the rib cage is it true or false good it is false brain is not protected by rib cage it is protected by skull stomach is a sense organ is it false or true yes it is false stomach is not a sense organ okay so it is false liver is the largest internal organ of our body is it true or false it is true tongue help us to see yes it is false very good children now here the last one for you draw five sense organs 